Hi everyone, I've got Shorty and Bumblebee and I've got my breakaway rope on which means we are at a breakaway jackpot. We're at the 4D Arena in Whitman, Arizona for the second breakaway jackpot that I've got to go to. Super happy that my horse is feeling good and we get to come to all these jackpots this winter. But we're running a little bit late and me and Shorty are up soon so let's go get warmed up and rope some calves. Oh, and stay tuned because today I hope that I get to see a horse I haven't seen in three years. I'm pretty sure he's going to be here. I used to own him. He's really special to me and I'd love to introduce him to you guys so maybe we'll get to check him out later. But right now I got to focus on roping. I got Shorty saddled. Gonna go get him warmed up and got my GoPro for y'all. They are dragon for round number two. I missed my first calf, but I wrote my second one and this one is progressive. So I'll only get one in the second round. And then if I catch and I'm fast enough, they'll take me to the short go. They're taking top 20 to the short go today. But what I am learning and realizing with breakaways, it's good to catch, but you gotta be going for it. So this next one, I'm gonna be going for it. My game plan is to rope it fast. Cause if I don't, I think I'll be too slow for the short go. So. Here is to throwing when you feel uncomfortable. No luck for Shorty and I. That's okay, we got Bumblebee in the novice horse. Fifteen Remy Wells, fifty-five Alma Beth, twenty-four Emmy Palmer. Be ready.
good. Tell me why. Thank you. Job. <laughs> Down by 27, Emory Palmer, 28, Kinsey Wolf, 29, Mason Ray Walker, 30, Katie Billingsley. 30, Emory Palmer, right in at 27. 462, 462. Thank you. Okay, 1355, 1355, breakout point, I'm all done roping on Bumblebee and they haven't done the results yet, but so far we're leading the average. But before things wrap up, I want to come introduce you to the horse that I haven't seen in person in three years. I did get to meet him and give him a hug earlier, but let's introduce Flynn. Hey Flynn. Let me turn the camera around. Okay, Flynn boy. You want me, Bumblebee? Okay, that's good enough. This is Flynn. I don't know if you guys remember him. He is the barrel horse in my intro video, and I had Flynn from a four year old to a nine year old, and then I sold him when he was nine, and he's 12 this year. And Flynn was my college rodeo horse. I did a lot of awesome things on him. He was super, super special to me. Insert Flynn memories here. Okay, so there's Flynn for you. He is now owned by a really awesome family that does a lot of junior rodeo. The daughter gets to break away, tie goat, head, heel, and sometimes run barrels on Flynn. So he is living the life. He gets to travel all across the US. It was my dream to make a horse that can compete in all these rodeo events and then him go kick butt with someone else. And that's exactly what Flynn did. He made a lot of my dreams come true and he's really special. I got to give him my own special hug and kiss but now you guys get to see him i love seeing all these horses we've sold back in arizona i'm sure i'll see flynn again in arizona coming up but in the meantime wish flynn and remy good luck on all their upcoming rodeos goodbye flynn kiss goodbye
Hey Bumblebee, as you're snacking, I'm gonna tell everyone how we did. Bumblebee and I got the fast time in the first round and the fast time in the second round and we won the average. So we entered twice, so we got to rope four calves. We were too long on the other two, but on our second entry, we did really good. So I was super happy with him. I rode him good. He was on his A game. I'm really happy with that. I'm sorry I didn't do good on you, Shorty. We'll get him next time, okay? They're finishing up with the novice roper right now, but we are all done. We're gonna go up and collect our winnings. The first checks that we've won the first checks I've ever won on Bumblebee and the first checks of my season. And it's just a beautiful day in Wickenburg. So what could be better? Okay, Bumblebee, you got me three checks tonight. Good job. And Shorty, it was in spirit. I couldn't have done it without you as well. Thank you. Thanks for coming along to our last minute jackpot adventures. I'm glad I have some horses and some good company. And we're in Wickenburg, Arizona, so I might as well come jackpot. And I am so happy to take you guys along the ups and the downs. We started off a little rough, but we ended her on a good note. I can't wait for the next one. If you guys want to tag along that one as well, make sure to subscribe to this channel. Hit the like button if you're enjoying my content and I'll catch you next time. Thank you.